Uganda Revenue Authority is taking all steps necessary to close all the gaps leading to tax revenue loss in the country. In this regard, it has enlisted the help of the Global Forum on Transparency and Exchange of Information platform to deal with the problem of tax avoidance and evasion that has become a common practice for many multinational entities in the country. If in your law um, there is a, 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 a certain a tax applying to um, Ugandan residents and you need information uh, that is uh, relevant to assessing the tax of that individual or that entity, then you can ask for information that you need to carry out that tax assessment uh, properly. The fact that many multinational companies are registered in other countries further increases the burden of enforcing compliance among them. It is very hard for the residency country, residence country to try to tax this income since strong protection of bank confidentiality and other secrecy provisions in tax havens make it hard for the residence country to get information about its residence foreign source income. The situation becomes grimmer with the knowledge that multinational corporations are among the top 100 taxpayers in the country, meaning that when they avoid or even evade paying tax, the impact is directly felt by the economy. Our economy is fully dependent on companies that are um, located outside our jurisdiction and if you're talking about if you are collecting 75 percent to fund our budget but out of that 75 percent 80 percent of them are multinational companies which are incorporated outside Uganda and we are operating in an environment where I cannot go where they are registered to ask what is this man doing here where I cannot follow through his account in that area. The problem of tax avoidance and evasion is bigger than just Uganda, with statistics indicating that over $50 billion is illegally exported from Africa through tax evasion, incorrect invoicing and pricing each year. There's therefore need for transparency and exchange of information to rectify this. Ingrid Nantege, NTV Business.